so I creamed the butter. I totally forgot to show you guys, but it was just butter in here uh, with the sugar. And then um, now the just the all-purpose flour mixture, okay? And I think I can make another batch. So I did, this is all the flour I had. So actually I didn't have enough all-purpose flour. So I mixed in a little bit of cake flour, but not just in a single recipe. Because this is just single, I mixed it in. So I'm gonna do one more. What was that, babe? Three? Three. So three and a half. Friends, this is how I bake. This is why when someone asks for a recipe, I honestly I it's not that I don't want to share, it's because I just make do with what I got. Okay, so that's you saw me put three and a half or maybe three and three quarters. Okay. My other, I have a, I like to, I like to work with a, uh, what do you call this, kitchen towel, and then a bowl where I can put all my dirty, um, <laughs> utensils, um, but I, this one is a chocolate one, and then I added a little bit of the strong coffee, I don't have a recipe for this, I'm kind of just winging it, and then I will dip it into, um, like white chocolate, so, just have a little bit of a this is the flour this is where I leveled the cocoa powder okay and then I'm gonna add it in here so I wanted to make sure that all the lumps out of the cocoa powder are gone so which is why I like kind of super beat it but yeah I mean it's just butter so there's no eggs in here mm. okay super good and then I'm gonna make guava like a guava, thick guava paste. So I'm gonna use this, and then I'm gonna cook it, and then I'm gonna dip it, okay, with the cookies. I think it's gonna work out. All right, friends. Danica has her little stuff. <laughs> chocolate and yeah. So she's playing. I'm making a hot mess here because I have a chocolate one, and then here, here are the ones that I've made. Uh, so this is just no nuts and then the other one I just um, you can put any nuts I put sometimes walnuts macadamia pine nuts um, whatever nuts I have I'll just grind it and then I'll mix it in and then uh, these are like the toppings I have so I can use those and that's my inspiration from um, Hawaii and that's what's in the oven from Danica. She made that. And so here is our first batch that we dip. So this one is white chocolate and this one is guava. Okay. Guava white chocolate. We still have that. And then this is our white chocolate with guava. This one is the white chocolate and then we have that. And then this is my guava mixture. So I'm going to put that here. Get it away from Danilin. Um, and then now we're going to do the chocolate. All right, friends. So here it is. This is what she's going to bring to the banquet. She's not going to bring the chocolate because it has um, nuts. And so we just got to make sure that everybody is able to enjoy it and eat it. And this is the chocolate chip cookies that I made. Also no nuts. Um, yeah, so not bad uh, for a banquet. Okay. All right. Thank you, friends. Mahalo. Aloha, friends. Good morning. Uh, okay. I, I am taking Jonathan's car going to floor, which is my, um, my other office my other real estate office where we do our um, floor time meaning um we do like um whoever calls in gets that call kind of thing uh if they're interested in looking for properties needing a real estate agent so you get like first dibs but i had a very productive week very very i was so busy okay. I, and i um those chocolate chip cookies, oh my gosh. I hope I told you guys the recipe because 
I never, I, I, I'm not, I'm an OCD. I don't follow. I follow rules in life, but when it concerns baking, I don't know. It's like it's so hard for me to follow our recipe to the T. Even when I make it for the first time. Like, you know, usually some bakers will make and will make it for the first time as is and then they'll adjust as they see fit. Oh no, not this lady. Um I just I just adjust. I just adjust. But it turned out so good. It was so soft. I still have like three like cookies in there into like a tight uh a tight container and that was Monday, right? So it's still good. I'm surprised there's still three in there. But um even after like the second day, even today, um it's soft. Soft and chewy. It did not become hard. Uh, which some of my cookies have become hard so really nice Martha Stewart Martha Stewart chocolate chip cookies maybe because I mixed in the cake flour was that no 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 that was the second batch of cookies <laughs> that was for my um the pineapple cut cookies that I that was really good too so uh yeah, that was really good. I, we went to the banquet for Danny last night for the volleyball. And all the all the moms and all the dads was like, and all the kids, like, oh my God, it's so pretty. And it was. I'm like, dang, girl. Um, it was because of the pink and the white. And then I, um, I added those chocolate chip uh, cookies in there. Those were freshly baked, though. Those were from the freezer. I did not want to... Um, Put those since because I baked it since Monday. I don't mind my family getting sick, <laughs> but I cannot. I don't like, you know, because I'm responsible. Like I said, I follow rules outside <laughs> of my um, comfort zone of baking. Anywho, okay, I'm off today from my first job, um, my transportation job. So today I took a day of absence. LOA leave of absence and so they granted it so I'm I have a three-day weekend and I was telling hubby we should go somewhere like I wanted to go to San Francisco or something or Disneyland we still have two tickets as a family to Disneyland and so it's only good until the end of the year because when we went during the summertime we were supposed to stay there four days and it was just too hot friends you I never learned my lesson and it's I'm just too old for this now but I cannot do Disneyland I just cannot with kids and it's so expensive now before before you had the fast pass and it was free like it was a fast pass you know then they charge extra for the fast pass which was like I think just 10 bucks right now there's this whole genie thing oh my gosh it's like I'm telling you, friends, when you go to the restaurant, and even at Disneyland, it's still the same, you know, you know me when I'm driving, I, I'm all over the place. But when you go to eat out, there is called, and I believe it is a true term, it's called shrinkflation, shrink, like smaller. So you're paying for more, but you're getting smaller things. So you're paying more for Disneyland because of course the tickets to go in is so much higher now. I don't know how much we paid. I think we paid 2,500, close to 3,000. Okay, because including this genie crap. And I love Disneyland, but wow. To be able to go through a fast track, like, to skip the line, the regular, there's still a line. It's not like you go in and there's no line. <coughs> to skip the long two hour line and just go into a 45 minute line or maybe 30 minute. Um, you pay $20 per person per ride on certain rides like the the, the race car. The um, Oh, it's flooded here. Oh, we've had a lot of rain. Oh my God. Oh boy. Uh, do you guys hear that? Oh wow, what's going on here? Oh boy. Um, so, and there was a family.
family of six. So can you imagine six times 20? That's $120 for one ride that we were so stupid to do. But Danny, Danica really wanted the, the car's ride. So that was extra $120 on top of like the $2,600 or $2,700 that we've already paid for. And that was just one ride. It wasn't like the whole day. It was just one ride, one time. Disney. Um, um, and then you go to the restaurant. We went to Original Pancake House. And I didn't film it, but it was the last vlog. And I always get the same thing. Because <laughs> I have issues. I have OCD. I hate ordering food. I just, I just don't know. Like, I don't know what to do. I just know what I usually get and then I just stick with it and then I'm fine with it you know but um it was the pancake and then it came with two eggs two scramble eggs okay and then it was four pancakes they still gave me four pancakes but I did notice that the pancakes were smaller like instead of a like big pancake because Danica and I shared it was like three quarters of the size and it cost more it was sixteen dollars for four pancakes and two eggs but it was good anyway yeah inflation friends i don't know how i feel so bad for families that are just trying to make ends meet because it's not it's not fair Ooh, uh oh it's not fair at all it's too this life is too expensive right now inflation Okay, it's so gloomy, I want to show you, but I'm a cautious driver, and I, oh, there it is. Sometimes I don't know, I don't know how to work Jonathan's car, because I don't touch, you know, I don't touch stuff. But, anywho, um, I'm going to the floor, I'm early, 30 minutes early, I just, I gotta open up the office, and turn on lights, and all that stuff, and then I'm gonna grab breakfast, and then Miss Mary's gonna meet me there, because we're gonna do some marketing flyers, and I haven't seen her in a while, that woman is just so busy, but she's doing her yoga, which is good, good for her, um, then, Jonathan and, and hubby are gonna go to a, um, UW, University of Washington football game. So Jonathan is an alumni. And I think they got free ticket. Nope, no, they got it from Costco. But um, Hobby really wanted to go take Jonathan to a football game. And then I'm off, so I'm gonna nuggle with Danica and it's gloomy and it's cold and it's rainy and it's a perfect day to have a day off. <laughs> I'll see you guys in a bit. Look at this, isn't this beautiful? All right, Miss Mary is already at Starbucks and she said the holiday cups are out. So of course, I gotta go see. Plus I gotta get coffee. But isn't this beautiful? Oh, it's raining, it's wet. Ooh. And I'm walking. And people are looking at me. Oh, there's Miss Mary. <laughs> Look at the leaves on the ground. <laughs> yes. Oh my goodness. Oh. oh my gosh, isn't that cute? It's too cute. How much are they? It's $24.95. I had my points. I'm using it. Look at this. Oh, oh I want one. You need to get one of these. Okay, you hold that. Okay, let me hold this. Oh, look at this one. It's a porcelain one. I don't do the porcelain one. What's that one? Are you going to this is that the, one? No, I don't need oh, it. Oh, okay. I don't even know if I need I it. Like, I'm gonna hold on to it. <gasps> Look at this one. Oh, I like oh these big God. ones. So I got this one. Oh, but my next one is gonna be this one. Oh, I like that one. Isn't it pretty? But I really wanted this one. Oh, there's those. They have a gold stud that they don't have out yet. Oh, why? And that's coming because it's not here. Oh. I mean, it's a really pretty gold. I saw it. Okay, on. I said I was not gonna buy any more. You've got a collection. Oh now. my gosh. I said they're so thing. pretty. Oh, I like this I one know, too. That was Oh, I like this one too. <coughs> I'm only doing hot cups. Mm. I'm not doing any more cold. Oh, this is really cute too. I like that one. Let's oh, get this one. Twenty four dollars, but I like the topper. Yeah, but don't you have points? I do. I think. think. Let's go check. This is Mary's outfit of the day. Okay, look, we're stepping out for lunch. Azula restaurant. Every time I'm with Miss Mary, I'm like useless. 
think we think about food all the time. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. It's my food not getting any lighter. Even when we do our open house, it's okay. It's 9 30. What are we having? It's for lunch? 10 o'clock. First agenda. What are we having for lunch? Exactly. <laughs> but look at the tree. So pretty. Look, the village. I love it here. Okay, so we are where? Azul. Azul. Okay, I got the blackened shrimp tacos with yes. the black beans and rice. And then look at Miss Mary's. Look oh at my the God. salsa. So good. I know, we need a second one. Thank you. Look at her food. Shrimp and avocado. Mmm, so good. All right. There's Miss Mary and I. We are going to a gala. That's so fancy. I know. <laughs> we are going to a networking gala, um, which she talked me into. She says, I need to be more sociable. But um, I put on this cute outfit. I got this at Express. Oh, really? Remember, weren't you with me? No. On clearance for like 11 bucks. Oh, my goodness. I know. I haven't gone to Express for years. I uh, who was with me? Time. I thought Probably you were with me. Remember when I was doing work um, shopping stuff? Work clothes shopping? Remember with the coach lady that tied that big knot? Oh. Of, like on my, oh, yeah. I could have gotten my coat! Oh, I could have used my coat. coat. <laughs> Your coat would have been handy right now. Uh, I couldn't figure out what, like, I'm like, what am I going to wear so I have a shawl? <laughs> I have a grandma shawl. Oh, gosh. I'm wearing a sweater. Oh, I could have used a coat. Oh, oh, well, right. next time. Next time we go to a gala. Yes. My first gala ever. Yes. Well, the holiday season's just started. Mm -hmm. This is the kickoff. All right. We're going to have better lighting because this lighting is not doing justice for our beauties. It can do so to us. You look beautiful. You look beautiful. You look good. All right, friends. Here. Oh, there's Miss Mary. We're all dressed up. Yeah. Ah, and then we're going to that building. Oh, it's so beautiful. We can see the view. I know. We need to take a picture. They have weddings here. Oh, oh yes, they got weddings here. I accidentally. And apparently it. galas. Yes. Thank you. All right. Let's do this. You got this. They have like an auction table where you put in your bed. I should get on this one. Yeah. The one year membership. <laughs> Massage, huh? Oh my god, there's the view. Not pretty. 